Maybe I should go over all the books I have in here. Cheers to that. I'm gonna do it. What's in here? My little Wobblo book. So I have this, and it should be autographed because I met Joey. Oh, I see it. I want to his book signing. Forget this box. I'm gonna keep it for something. Um, bear with me. Some of these, most of these books, or all of them, I haven't even read yet. I think the only one I read is this one, which is really, really good. That's his first book. And obviously, this book I read when I was a kid. There was an old lady who swallowed some books. No, that was a fly that I read. I, I swear. What year was this? Scholastic. Yeah. So that's 2013. So it's not that old. 2012. Oh, that's why. So I have this Nicole Richie book. Nice cover on Joey. I have this book, which I just said is the best book, and I should probably read it again. And the second book I should read, because I don't think I've read it. The, yeah, this Pierce Hilton one, I have just, like, looked at the pages. That's hot. Loves it. And she follows me on Twitter. Here's the other Joey Contino books. I think I only read the first one and I'm not even done. I'm a, one of those gals and people that reads a book and then doesn't finish it. Also, I'm not the best at reading. Oh, and then I have some Twilight and Hunger Game books. This is New Moon, which to me is my least favorite out of the movies. I don't know about the books. Oh, somebody gave this book... True story. So then I gave Harmony this book, I think, at school. And I should read it and watch the movie, even though I hope the movie's not that good. If there's a movie, because I don't know which ones the movies are. I've only seen the first one. Oh, and I read this book, because this is the first Joey book that I got for Christmas for my cousin. Thank you. And this is a pretty good book. I learned a lot about him. He's a good singer, too. I'd love for him to be on the mass singer. Catching Fire. Love the movies. Nicholas Sparks. Maybe all his stuff is good. I, I like the movie. It, at first it starts out slow, but then it gets really good, the movie. I haven't read the book yet. Like I said, I don't really read books that much, even though I have a lot. Um, do you collect anything and then don't really use it? Heath Ledger. It passed too soon. I should read this one. Hollywood's Dark Store. A keto book, which I should look at and do recipes because it's always good and healthy. Nancy Grace. I love her. And I'll probably watch her show tonight when the new episode is uploaded. I should read the 11th. But um, I tried to find this book for the longest time and then finally found it at Goodwill. This book... I think this might be an 80s book. Like, every person my age or so probably has read this book. Oh, it's the 90s. 91. But that says cover art. Who knows? Maybe it was available in the 80s, too. Oh, and it's the third one. I swear JP has some of these. Shout out to him. This book is pretty old, too. 1986. I bet JP knows about this one. The little old lady who was not afraid of anything. Oh. I got this because that Shane Woodley and I like American Gold. The movie's okay. Another Nicholas Spark, The Best of Me. I'm gonna read the book. The movie, mm, it was one of my least favorite of the movies. Alan. I should probably read this. It doesn't have that many pages, it looks like. 
And I'm not going to say how I feel about him because I don't want to get into an argument. I'm not going to say the name of them because I'm probably going to pronounce it wrong. 19, this one says 1995, even though these books were popular in the 80s. It's a teasing one. And then there's the Christmas. If you take a mouse to the movies, a Christmas special edition. These books are always good. Even though I don't like rodents, I like these books. So... That's why I saw in this box. I'll probably have more to show you. Peace, love, and harmony. Have a great weekend. I gotta put these all back. I don't want that part.